Stephen Z. Killer has become powerful. His channel has hit over 100,000 subscribers. He keeps getting stronger and has more room to grow. So subscribe to Stephen Z. Killer today. What's up, everybody? Stephen Z. Killer bringing out some spooky, creepy Halloween goodness. It is the month of October. We're here to check out some spooky, creepy videos. And today we're checking out this one. Uh, it is called Water's Edge by Crypt TV. Now, I do want more recommendations. This was one of the recommendations I did get. Uh, this one has quite a few views on it. It's got 1.4 million views. Came out in 2019. Crypt TV is really good. There's a lot of their stuff that I've already seen. But if you guys know which ones I've already seen, you have suggestions of ones I definitely haven't seen, let me know down below. I do have about five different videos as of right now that I will be reacting to that is involving Crypt TV. Now, if there's other videos out there that don't involve Crypt TV uh, and are spooky, creepy, and all that kind of stuff, then let me know about it in the in the comments, and I'll try to react to it this month of October uh, and or whatever. I might even do a huge reaction section, uh, like live on Halloween too, checking out the things I wasn't able to make individual videos, and maybe recheck out some videos from a long time ago just to enjoy some time. So either way, we're still on the road to 120,000 subscribers, and I know we can do it based off of this right here, showing 77% of you guys watching are not subscribed. Now, if you're not subscribed, it means two things: one, you're returning, or brand new. If you're returning. Welcome back. How you doing? Hopefully this is the video that gets you hit that subscribe button today. And if you're brand new, welcome. Hope you enjoyed to see you for the very first time. Check out more content on the chan channel and hopefully you as well hit that subscribe button today. All right. Anyways, we're going to get into this. I'm going to have a lot of fun. Uh, I'm, I've been looking forward to some more creepy, spooky videos. And uh, I am doing the green screen effect. If you guys like this, I think this is going to work. It's going to add more atmosphere. Um, and uh, yeah, let's enjoy this creepy Water's Edge. Once again, uh, link will be down below. Go like the original video. Do all that good stuff. And let's get into this. There is I will be pausing and talking uh, if you don't want that fuck shit. So, uh... Off the bat, what the fuck is going on? Black all eyes, we saw you in there. So now, help me, please. We got Oh! Where is it? Where is it? Uh, he ain't walking normal for months. Damn. You tell me where to find him. Fuck you. Damn. That a boy fucking fight back. Don't. Oh, your hand though. Oh my god. What the fuck did they do to your hand? Holy shit. Uh, that's not normal. There, 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 there's no, there's no saving that hand. I, I, I think that thing has to go. Oh, he wasn't hammering the legs. He was hammering the hand. Okay. Ah! 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 I've had so many ankle injuries in my life. Oh. Oh, I hate when that... The ankle roll. The ankle roll! Oh. Fuck. That's it. That's the monster. Uh, 
So they know about a creature. Now I'm super intrigued. That man's still dying, by the way. He ain't dead. He dying, though. You know, I'd be like this. You bitch, you guys are already killing me. Hey, fucking monster! Dinner's ready! Ding, ding, ding! Fuck these two. If I already... Because look at that. He took an axe to the back with like four or five hits. And he ain't surviving. At least I'd get the bitches that killed me. That's what I'd work for. Oh, there's an ad. There's... Looks like there's a child outside. I saw, like, a raincoat. Bye bye arm! Karma, bitch! Now, to be honest, I don't even know if these guys are good guys or bad guys, or if this guy was a bad guy and they're fucking him up because he did some fuck shit. But either way, they're fucking dead. Oh, he's fucking dead. They left that creature a snack. One week earlier, okay. This is about a 20 minute video too. Hopefully there's no more ads to deal with, but I hope to remember to remove them all in editing. If I don't, then F. We're gonna have Wi-Fi, right? Nope. No Wi-Fi, no landline. We are off the grid. No more pitiful looks in town or neighbors showing up with casseroles. I hope her... Uh, How's that sound? Uh, this okay. kid might be dead. Because that was the father that was killed earlier. We're not savages. Yes, ma'am. That's never good. Shut up, phone. Hey, 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 Lexi. This is a tender moment and you're ruining it, phone. Putting it on silent. I'll go get mom's chair tomorrow, okay? The little girl wants her chair. You have to remember, even though mom's not with us anymore, she's always going to be right here for you. And so will I. Now, why don't you go outside and play? It's a beautiful day out. Oh, my prince said there are monsters in this part of the woods. The monsters, they eat up all the sad people because the monsters are sad too. You're telling me you believe in monsters now? Come on, go outside and play. 
But don't stray too far, all right? Hey, your dad got you a sandwich. Be happy. See, I've never been the, the type to wa like do shit like this. I wouldn't want to wander wander in a fucking forest by myself. Oh, oh rip sandwich. Oh no. Mommy? Is her reflection going to be in the water? That's never good. Lexi? Lex? Fucking called it. Also, I noticed the the purple crystal because there was a uh, one of the um, one of creep. It's been a while. Like I said, I haven't watched Crypt TV since last October. Um, one of the other ones involves like uh, that purple crystal. Literally, is what manifests when there's a monster that is like harboring the area, and it's the one thing that can stop it as well. If I'm wrong, whatever, but. That ain't your mom. Touch the water and you can get me back. Don't don't touch the water. Don't touch the little girl. Little girl. What the fuck happened? Fucking fuck! I was fucking pause it and then that shit happens. Okay. Oh, you. What the fuck are these aquatic monkey men thingy majigs? The thing about it is, his daughter didn't look like he was killed by those. That she was killed by those things. It looked like she got fucking drowned, and she was drowned for like at least several days because of the color of her skin and everything and the way it looked. What? Lexi? Wait a second! Hold the fuck up! One second. 
One second, one second. I gotta check. I gotta check. Damn it, I wanted to pause on the face. That's fine. Lexi? Oh, that's the face I wanted. Lexi? So the mom was technically revived because she touched the water, I guess? But she turned into this fucking creepy ass bitch? Alrighty then. Or is that supposed to be the daughter? That's his daughter now? I'm assuming that's probably the body parts and stuff of the couple that was trying to Revive her, his daughter. That ain't your daughter anymore, buddy. That you should have fucking chopped the head off while I was asleep. Damn it! You ain't never been a good shot. Could oh. Well, oh, I think we know what brother dies. Anyway. <laughs> hey, I ain't going any further. Okay, there are monsters in these parts. The creeks in these woods are said to tempt you with your deepest desires. And those who fall prey, they may become one of the wall bones. They used to be people. Now they're just feeding. Lonely, desperate souls. Trying to make Kill it! Feel whole again. That's a lot of crap. Listen, people go missing in these woods all the time. What is it you think got my friend Caleb? He came out to these woods, got separated from his friends, and something got him. Damn, fucking ripped out the heart and everything. <laughs> what have you been smoking? Can you hook your big sister up or something? <laughs> to hell with y'all. Ah. Uh, buddy, you just, uh, you just fucked yourself. Hey, he has got a crossbow. He may do some damage. I don't think he's lasting long, though.
See, my thing is I wouldn't keep my eyes off of it. What? Where the fuck did the crossbow go? He was holding it. He didn't put it down. He didn't fucking clip it on anything. Where the fuck did it go? <sighs> Bitch, don't try to take a selfie with it. Fucking shoot in the head. <sighs> and someone's going to call you. Oh, never mind. It just disappears. It's next to him. <laughs> no, no, wait, wait, wait. Jackson! Ellie! I got proof! I saw it! I saw a goddamn monster behind me! I told you! I got it! I got proof! Wait. Holy hell! Will! Damn, he got got hella fast. Okay, this doesn't make sense. I, I, I understand that this is his daughter, but why the fuck do these people now torture and kill him for the brother when it was kind of their fault for not believing him? They had a shot on it, and they decided to chase him? They're stupid. A little bit of plot is kind of stupid. Because to be honest, he's trying to kill his own daughter. I would have worked with these people. They have a reason to kill him. And yeah, I understand it's your daughter, but there's no going back from where she came from. Shoot him in the fucking head. Man, he died like a bitch. That doesn't make it right. Maybe we can call it even. Nope, you dead, bitch. <laughs> oh, he's still alive. God damn, he's a tough motherfucker. And now he dies. Water's Edge. A little bit of fan on the on, on the story, but wasn't bad.
The chick with the fucking cyber arm! From the other series. What happened to her cyber arm? The one with the crystal in it. That's a different one. That's not the little girl one. It's okay. Get your fucking snot ass off of me. Eat. That's for you. then but that wasn't the little girl one that was like a, uh, a different one that definitely wasn't the same interesting still very good uh the writing was a little bit eh with uh like the direction of things because the father wanted to kill the daughter then he fucking changed his mind then he's trying to then th then he for some reason per Text her even though he technically should take her out of the misery because she ain't gonna be normal ever again let's be honest and the whole you your daughter that's a monster now killed our brother now we kill you kind of stupid on their end and you know what at the same time there was at least a good jump scare or two solid but not the greatest if you guys have more suggestions let me know down below in the comments and uh, thank you for watching once again. And until the next one, later. This is the Prince of the Motherfucking Saiyans. And I am ordering you to subscribe to Steven Z Killer.